James catches, puts up a three. Won't go. Rebound, Bosch. Back out to Allen. His three-pointer. Bang! Tie game with five seconds remaining. Spurs do not have a timeout. Ray Allen was born in Merced, California when Walter Allen Sr. and Flora Allen welcomed a bouncing baby boy on July 20th, 1975. As the third of five children, Allen grew up in Saxmundham, England, where his love for football, basketball, and soccer grew. He also co-starred along Denzel Washington in the Spike Lee film, He Got Game. He's also been featured in other movies like Harvard Man and Uncle Drew. Career Allen played in the iconic Hillcrest High School in South Carolina, where he led them to their first state championship game. His stellar talent made him see offers from various colleges before accepting the offer from the University of Connecticut. Ray averaged 23 points per game and shot 46.6% from downtown for the Huskies. Talk about a sniper. Some impressive records that earned him two-time First Team All-American and Big East Player of the Year award. Allen, together with Rebecca Lobel, became the first player to have their number retired by UConn. Talk about respect. In the 1996 draft, he was chosen fifth overall by the T-Wolves, but was traded to the Bucks that night for Stephon Marbury. A draft that saw many greats like Allen Iverson, Steve Nash, and Kobe Bryant. Talk about legendary. Most of us know Ray's career and that he was widely considered the greatest shooter on the planet before being surpassed by the baby-faced assassin. But here's some fun facts. Allen is number six all-time in free throw percentage with an amazing 89.39%. He is also the first player to have two games in the finals with at least seven three-pointers. Ray is a 10-time All-Star and most of us know about his two rings. And how can we ever forget the greatest clutch shot in NBA history to tie Game 6 of the 2013 Finals with 5.2 seconds remaining on the clock? What a clutch gene. Now that we know a little about Ray's b-ball career, let's get into how he gets that paper, baby. Contracts Ray Allen's rookie deal was a three-year, $6.1 million deal with the Bucks. Allen's talent wowed the Bucks, and he led them to the playoffs in his second year. In 1999, Ray signed a six-year rookie max worth a cool $70 million. In 2003, Allen got traded to Seattle with Ronald Murray, Kevin Ollie, and a first-round pick for Desmond Mason and Gary Payton. Then in 2007, he got traded to Boston with Glenn Davis for Jeff Green, Wally Zerbiak, and more. Allen was paid $20 million for two years by Boston and then made $3.1 million in his last year with Miami. Over his entire playing career, Allen made over $180 million in salary alone. Talk about being a baller. Endorsements When it comes to endorsements, Ray Allen got his name pretty high on the board as he managed to pen down some big deals in his career. Ray was one of the players to see potential in the Jordan brand when it was expanding and has lived the sneaker aficionado's dream. Being one of the longest tenured Jordan brand athletes, Allen was the first other star ambassador of the brand. This was just after Jordan retired and we all didn't know what the next chapter would be. But Ray was first for Jordan brand and the growth has been spectacular. He's done lots of commercials over the years. We love the Air Jordan 2.5 Christmas Sugar Ray and Jordan 5 Away. Good luck trying to find these babies. So with that, Ray Allen has a net worth of Gotcha! Later on that, Allen is a real OG shooter. Now let's see how he spends that moolah. House Being one of the best shooters to the rim, we all know how much of a sharpshooter Ray Allen is. But when it comes to off the court, Ray Allen knows how to make his shots a great deals. Before he took his talents to the heat, he purchased a humongous 11,000 square foot home in Boston. This mansion features nine bedrooms and bathrooms, a six-car garage, theater, and a game room. And it also sports 1.44 acres of land. Allen purchased this mind-blowing beauty for a cool $4.6 million and listed it on the market for $5.2 million. Ray purchased a huge 11,500 square foot mansion in Coral Gables, Florida that sits on 37,000 square feet of land. This mansion features 10 bedrooms and 10 bathrooms of various sizes. It comes with a private beach, a sauna, library, elevator, spa bath, and a private gymnasium. Anyway, Allen dropped a sweet $11 million for this baby. 
Talk about that lifestyle, baby. If I could just sleep on that beach. Cars. Back in 2019, Ray Allen put his game on a whole nother level as he added to his breathtaking car collection. I bet you won't be able to imagine the car that Allen took a shot at. This is the Maserati Levante GTS as he got an entirely personalized car for Maserati's one of one customization program. This baby stole the New York International Auto Show. He also owns a 2002 custom designed Ferrari F60 Spider. This black beauty is worth a staggering 40,000. Talk about keeping it sleek. Charity. Ray won the hearts of fans not only by his good looks and jumper, but also by his desire to consistently give back to his community. Allen founded the Ray of Hope Foundation in 1996. Its mission is to assist with sports-related community-based programs and provide avenues of opportunities through which youth can hope to realize their full potential. Allen is also a deep-rooted lover of culture and history and has brought teammates and friends to this experience, earning him an appointment into the United States Holocaust Memorial Council. Ray has also made numerous sizable donations, one of which includes a donation of a new computer lab with 30 brand new computers to Hartford Simpson Waverly School. Love Life. Ray Allen met his heartbeat in 1996 in a party a night before his NBA draft and became friends ever since. The two lovebirds made their relationship formal in 2004 and dated for four years. On August 16, 2008, they decided to tie the knot and are currently proud parents of five kids. They have four boys named Walker, Winston, Walter and Wynn, and a girl named Tiara. Real quick, we wanted to give a shout out to Naruto for suggesting this video. If you engage with us in the comments or community post, you'll be eligible for a shout out from Big Time Hoops. Then your life will be complete. Net worth. And now, the time we've all been waiting for. How much is Ray Allen worth? With everything going on in his life, Ray Allen has a net worth of close to $100 million. That is one hell of a career, wouldn't you say?